Hello everyone. Sad news with the passing of legendary actor Rudger Hauer. Uh, so this video here will be a tribute with the end theme for Blade Runner, the classic Vangelis theme. Alright, so I'll uh, play the uh, main lead uh, melody for you, and then we'll get into this uh, sequenced bass part too. Alright, so let me show you those parts, and then I'll give you the details for them later. Here we go. Okay, so for starters we have this main synth lead melody, and uh, it's pretty smooth, pretty uh, legato notes here, uh, fun to play, all right? And we're going to start it here, you kind of want to get some like, some of that buzzsaw lead tone, so just kind of, you know, a little bit of a gnarly distortion on there. Okay, maybe a little uh, like room reverb, some chorus effect. And uh, I'll leave you all the uh, links for the effects I'm using in the description box below if you want to check them out. Okay, so just some cool effects on there. And uh, start it here by hitting that first fret on the B for a measure. Okay, then we move to 3, 1, to open on the G. Okay, hold that for a couple measures. Then we come back to the 3 on the G. Then we come off to second G, open to three on the D. All right, hold that for a couple measures. And this last bit here, uh, we do first on the G, open three D, three A. Cap it all off with a first D and three on the A. All right, and essentially that uh, melody will just repeat. Okay, so let's try it all up to tempo now. this uh, bass section, which will be based on that uh, really cool sequencer in the um, original recording here. And uh, it's going to require, you know, some pretty gnarly technique with the picking. Okay, we need to get that, uh, you know, 16th note picking, basically. Alright, so just that continuous alternate picking on the bass here. Um, if you have nimble fingers, then uh, you know, you're better than me, but <laughs> I use a pick for this. And uh, it's basically the tuning on this, you want to drop everything down a whole step. Okay, so we'll be at D, G, C, and F. All right, and that just makes this a whole lot easier. Um, so you don't have to be, you know, using pinkies and all that business. You can just keep everything open, basically. All right, so, and essentially what we're doing, we'll just be jumping strings going open, two, three, all right? And we're just gonna be shifting strings for uh, the riff here, all right? And, you know, you can either detune everything yourself, uh, which is fine, or 
you can cheat and use like a pitch shifter and just drop everything down a step with that. So that's a handy tool. Okay, so uh, like I said, we'll start here with the open uh, third string here, which was the D, well, it's C string now. Okay, second from the bottom here. And like I said, basically we're just going a couple opens, two, three, just very quickly. We're gonna do it about 16 times, all right? So about 16 times with that. And then we're gonna shift up to what was the A string, now the G string, second from the top. And same deal, couple opens, two, three, do that about eight times. Shift again to the top string now, so the D string. Just doing it slowly for you here so you can just check it out all right eight times with that and then up to what was the g string the very bottom string here uh, 16 times with this okay you get the drift and then finish where we started on the previous d string now the c string second from the bottom here and uh 16 times there Okay, and you would just hold that basically until that uh, previous melody starts over again. All right, so now I'll just do the whole thing up to tempo for you here and uh, see about, you know, type of speed you need on this. So uh, here we go, let's check it out. Thanks for checking out the video, everybody. Like it, share it, leave a comment. It's always good to hear from you. Um, do me a favor and hit the subscription button. I put out a video pretty frequent, so you don't want to miss out on that. Uh, check out the links in the description box below. I have really cool links for uh, tablature books, all the gear I use, t-shirts, fun stuff like that. So thank you very much, and we'll see you next time.